desperately need a night to just like decompress and like give some attention to myself because I am a super like self how do I word this so I am a person that like just fixates and like thinks about everything I could have done better and thinks about like literally every single thing um and I'm very self-conscious I'm very aware that I'm self-conscious I'm very aware that I'm a people pleaser but I'm like learning how to set boundaries and learning how to put myself first in my adult years I kind of learned that in the last few years but this week I've had a really crappy week for my mental health um I've been feeling really bad about my body I've been feeling really bad about like what I've been doing at work and like I lost a couple of clients just like it's for the best but like it still gets to me and I still like sit there and think about what I could do wrong and if I'm disappointing people by like that client leaving am I disappointing my boss am I not living up to what he thought like it's just all this stuff I've just felt really bad this week I've kind of like buried myself in giant sweaters and baggy sweatpants and like just haven't felt great so I have struggled with body dysmorphia since high school it's been a thing and then once I got married, I gained 30 pounds and like, I, most of the time I just don't care. I feel like I've gotten to a point in my life where I'm like, I look healthy. Like in high school, I didn't look healthy, but then there's just those like random times where my brain decides to tell me, nope, you hate yourself. So it's, it's fun. So I need a night to like decompress and focus on me and be positive and like take care of myself and do things that make me happy. So first I am in my little cozy room and I'm sitting on the floor just because, well, my dogs are in both of the chairs and my dogs come first. So I didn't want to kick them out and I just felt like it was more comfy to sit on the floor. So I don't know. So I think tonight I'm just gonna like, we went to Lush to pick up a couple things today. I got a face mask and I got some like really yummy smelling, I think it's like a bath melt. Um, I've never used one of their bath melts. I haven't been there in a long time. Um, and I got a bath bomb, of course. So I think I'm going to go take my makeup off, pick out some cozy clothes, take a bath, read my book, do my skincare. I really want to make a hot coffee. It is freezing. I don't know what else after that. Like take some time to not focus on the things that are stressing me out and not think about them and do things that are making me happy because I find that when I like randomly do these self-care nights, they just make me feel better. I just feel like lifted a little bit. So let's get started because... I need this. Also, I wanted to show you a couple of things. I made a TBR, which I never do that because I am 100% a mood reader and I have a lot of different moods that I could be in. Um, oh, by the way, here's one chair, Milu. Here's the other chair with Nacho. So I, I couldn't kick them out. How do you kick them out? <laughs> you can't. Anyways, I made like a little TBR. So this is what I'm reading right now with my mom. We started the series. I have most of them, but I'm missing like the last couple. I'm excited to read those. I also want to show you my new rug. Me and my husband went searching everywhere for a rug. This room has been a work in progress and I'm going to make a video about this room um, or about my whole house. I'm redoing my whole house, but like we still need new curtains. We still need to take the records down. They're just not the vibe in this room anymore, but we found a rug. And we found it at Ross and it is so cute. Like this, this is my self care because this living room has never looked this cute. If you can ignore my chaotic background, that would be great. We're in the middle of painting the mm -hmm. kitchen, but I wanna show you, I made friends. Like I made friends. I haven't had friends since like 
This sounds so sad, but I haven't had friends outside of my husband since like my sophomore year of high school. Um, something happened to me my junior year of high school and I got really like isolated and bullied after that. So as a 25 year old, I joined Bumble BFF and like put myself out there because I adore my husband. I love him. I love spending time with him, but I just needed like girls to be around. So I joined Bumble BFF and I made friends and I'm so excited. And one of them gave me this mug for Christmas. It was a two pack and I'm so excited. So we're gonna use this cause it makes me happy. I try so hard to be one of those aesthetic girlies, but I'm just, I'm just not. And I'd rather be like myself with my tools that my husband is replacing our light switch with. Call me crazy, I know it's nighttime but I don't have any decaf ones. Honestly, caffeine does not affect me. So we are not making decaf. Let me show you guys my favorite coffee creamer of all time. Like, hold on. So back when I was in student teaching, I went to my mentor teacher's house to like, plan and stuff and she put me on Chobani creamer and I know it's pretty popular now whoa I know it's pretty popular now but at the time it was not and literally have never gone back with a little bit of Tarani vanilla and it is For those of you who have Nespresso, the bubbles, ugh. I'm sorry, no, let's get past those. There we go. Also, look at how cute our little Star Wars mug is. It's like our favorite mug in the house because like you can have it out and we know what it is, but like not everybody does. It's the same idea with these pictures. I traced them on an iPad. It's Tatooine, um, Naboo, and Coruscant because Steven's favorite character is Anakin. He's from Tatooine. Ignore the pencil marks. My favorite character is Padme. She's from Naboo. And then Coruscant is like where they come together. Okay, so I'm going to see what candles we have and get the bathroom all set up. Going to go take off my makeup. I'm going to find some cozy clothes clothes everything is dirty we've been so focused on our house like just redoing everything that like i just don't know where anything is and it's stressing me out this is a christmas candle it's merry cookie So it might be a little bit loud, but while the bath is running, I kind of wanted to show you what I got from Lush. So they gave me two little samples of the Ocean Salt Face and Body Scrub. So I might try this because I do have a lot of dry skin right now. Ooh, it smells super yummy. They also gave me a sample of Charity Pot Lotion. My mom is obsessed with this and swears by it. This is the face mask that they recommended to me for dry skin. It's called Beauty Sleep. Um, it's super purple. She said it has honey in it. And then this is the cool little, I've never seen this before. I haven't been in there for a long time, but it's the same lotion that I used to use. So I love the scent. This is a aroma and bath melt. And then I got this bath bomb. I don't remember what it's called. But it's one of their Valentine's Day ones. The whole is meant for like a love note. And then for Christmas, in a white elephant gift, I got the Laneige sleep mask. 
Uh, my lips are always dry. I feel like this hasn't helped yet, but we will see. rejuvenated honestly I just feel really relaxed I'm glad I got a chance to like just sit down and read I read quite a bit I was in there for a lot longer than I thought I was gonna be but the bath bomb mixed with the bath melt felt felt and smelled amazing but I'm a little afraid I was I was a little afraid that I stained my bathtub because my hand was completely pink and the edge of my bathtub was pink um but it went away I did the face mask and it actually felt really good. To be completely honest, I don't feel up to doing my whole like 20 step skincare routine. So I'm just gonna do the essentials tonight. I'm gonna start with my Bioma Hydrating Serum. If you've watched my other videos, you guys know that this one is like a must have in my routine. I'm gonna use the Ordinary's Hyaluronic Acid because Hyaluronic Acid is a Dry Skin Girl's best friend. I'm out of this, but I'm like using the leftovers. It's the Glow Recipe Nice out of my dew drops. This is the Bioma Eye Gel. I'm gonna use the Cosrx Snail Mucin Power Essence. I'm crazy, I'm gonna put on three different snail mucin products because it's great for hydration. This is a new one that I'm trying. It's a black snail mucin. It's a collagen serum. I'm using my favorite moisturizer, Hero Clear Collective, the prebiotic moisturizer. This is the Cosrx All-in-One Cream. I think I'm gonna go set up my PS5 and play Minecraft for a little because what's better self-care than playing Minecraft? For me. <laughs> so I'm gonna go set up Minecraft and play Minecraft for a little. My husband is working on a few things, so we're not gonna like relax yet or we might just play games tonight, honestly. But this is like the bulk of the video, so I'm just gonna like say bye now just in case I forget to later, but I might have an outro, so keep watching. Keep watching regardless, but I'm being honest, sometimes I just forget to film an outro, so if I do, bye, but keep watching.